and a creepy Santa. Yeah. Just when you thought this Christmas couldn't get any bleaker, it does. Are you going to give Santa a cuddle? Yeah? <laughs> Happy Christmas, everyone. See you in therapy. Uh-oh. I can't watch. Ouch. Right on his red nose. As if it wasn't sore enough. Oh, no, they did Another wound to the forehead. Oh. The crowd is turning. Rudolph the It's starting to look more like Rudolph the Red-Nosed Rat. <laughs> there appears to be a bouncer at the door of this party. It's actually the You've Been Framed Christmas Party. And that's Chris the producer singing and his sister dancing. Here's to another great year. I want to catch the snowball. Oh yeah, big deal. <laughs> John Barrowman's house in Cardiff. It's like this all year round, not just at Christmas. The welcoming illuminated figures draw the unwary. Like a Camp Venus flytrap, they offer succor. Next door is Charlotte Church's place. She's not rising to it. <laughs> nice one, Charlie. Now, and uh-oh, looks like Santa's been on the sherry again. child mentally scarred by a headless Santa. Oh! Now another Christmas icon leads our kids into a further world of eternal nightmares. <laughs> ah, lovely this, isn't it? It's for the kids really, isn't it, Christmas? That's my Christmas. 
Pretty little mistake to see it off those sprouts, though. It's way trains. Watch Joy first. Mm, not much of a start, but have no fear. It builds. That's why they're called bumpers. Are you okay? The plight of the iPad orphan. Neglected while parents try to beat angry birds. But there is a solution. <laughs> it's Elise, the human slinky. Are you okay, Elise? The irony is she was hoping to get one for Christmas. Such is life. Mmm, snow. Delicious. Refreshing. Snow. Nature's own slush puppy. Try to avoid the brown bits. Why do you guys know it's brown? <laughs> MJ may have gone, but his music lives on, and so do his moves. Look out for the sledge. It always goes past at that time. Santa will insist on wearing his shiny, patent leather kinky boots. But there's just no grip on them. Get down dulcis and get some wellies. As the credits roll on another episode of Alex Zane's Root Tune, a bored teenager turns to a remote-controlled helicopter for excitement. And who can blame her? Hang on a minute. Phone Princess Eugenie. I've just had an idea for a new hat. <laughs> Meanwhile, round at David Essex's house, his young nephew is trying to get the hang of the yo-yo. Show him how it's done, Dave. <laughs> Everybody! It was only a winter's tale. Undertakers won't go out if it's been snowing, so if someone dies on Christmas Eve, you have to bury them where they fell. <laughs> Wait! It's not dead! Hang on, that's Michael Gove, isn't it? Hit him with a shovel and do it properly this time. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas to you, too. What's on your leg, huh? What's on your <laughs> Even though she's no longer First Lady, Barbara Bush is still very much a target for snipers. That sniper has locked onto Barbara from outside, but she knows you can brush off a laser sight just like you would with a wasp. And Liza Minnelli is loving every minute. Christmas time. Sing it, Cliff. Mistletoe and wine. So this is the result of mistletoe and wine, is it? I'm saying there's been more wine than mistletoe. They don't breathalyze for mistletoe, unless the nipples get back in. Coming up, strange noise like a gobbling turkey from someone in this room. Or maybe it is a turkey. It's escaped from the oven. these new crackers from Walls. Each one contains a different uncooked sausage. And you can't blame Eric. There's a pork and leek banger in there. When you pull the cracker, there's enough explosive to cook the sausage. It's ingenious. I'm starving. You only ever cooked you the last stupid bit of cracker. I want a hat as well, that's a joke. See ya. thought about putting our dogs to work to cut our petrol bills, but there are drawbacks. <laughs> we always end up down at some cat's house. As well as nuts, squirrels also hoard fairy lights for the winter. Squirrels compete with their neighbours and try to make their nests look the most festive. The squirrels in my garden have built a life-size moving replica of a squirrel Santa, and it's not even for charity. A snowman of comedy legend Tommy Cooper, of course. <laughs> Not everyone's a fan. Everybody! <laughs> 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 <laughs>
And now a cat doing an impression of a tortoise on Red Bull. Are you ready, Christmas trees? All together, Timber! Three wheeze men. But what happens next? Find out after the break.